Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to go through how to export data from RE Explorer MLS into an Excel spreadsheet. So you go into your, your MLS like you typically would. For this exercise, we're going to go search off market only. Then I'm going to pick my status search. I'm going to pick closed. I'm going to go to area 201. I'm going to leave it on detached. And right now you're pretty much ready to go. You're uh, ready to export this. So we're going to go up to the View tab. And then now you can set up your own custom report and your own custom spreadsheet. But if you don't want to take the time to do that, what you can do is just go down to eNeighborhood, hold down your, left, your control button, and left click eNeighborhood. And what it'll do is it'll bring it into you as a spreadsheet format. And then you would click Open and just that fast it brought us in here to a spreadsheet we ended up getting control down we ended up getting 340 records and it goes from see control up arrow let's see how far it went back so we got from 2005 until 2008 so I'm just gonna make a quick graph on this let's see what, we, what else we've got here All right, so I'm just going to make a quick graph. So I'm going to take the close date, put it right in front of there. And let's see what this market's been doing. Okay, well, we do have a few different segments here. We have this segment, this segment up here, and of course, this segment down here. So before you graph, you know, as, as you learn in the video, um, you definitely want to segment the market. But let's just see what this overall market is doing right now. Alright, one second here. See if it can give us a clear idea. So there we go. So we started to, we peaked around what, 06? Around 5 of 06 and have been declining since then. So that's how you download from RE Explorer out of the Illinois area. This is Anthony Young, www.thegraphguy.com. Enjoy, take care, happy graphing.